everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rick's Gadgets. So a couple videos back, I did the video on the dome door and window sensor. And I said I had a project for it. And what I was going to do was I was going to take the door and window sensor and attach a switch to it that I could mount in my mailbox and use this for notification uh, when my mailbox is open and closed. Um, so what I did was, uh, I didn't get a picture of it before I put it in the case here, but on this sensor, um, this is the cover for it, um, right here where the magnet read switch uh, is positioned on the circuit board, there were two pins, and what that did was it allowed me to hook or solder a wire to those two sensors, so instead of running it as a read switch, I now have this tilt switch and what it does is as I move it back and forth and the door opens and closes it will show my status as open and closing and actually you can see it here I tilt it up and down and you can see how the status changes here within HomeSeer so what I did was I just took a one inch piece of PVC pipe put a cap on it and slid the the sensor up into the the pipe and I put a little wad of rag in there just to keep anything from getting up in there and I just packed the end of it full of silicone and you can see there I did leave a little bit of a gap for air just so if there was moisture anything it could get out I uh, didn't want it to uh, trap moisture in there and plus I left the uh, the cap unglued uh, so if I needed to I could pop the top off and push it out the other way to, to change the battery so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna mount this and I found out from playing that the range to my mailbox was limited if I put it inside the mailbox because it was metal so I had to go this route and I'm gonna mount it on the back side nearest the house so I could get the range so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go out there and get this mounted and show you how I mounted it and show it uh, on the door. Now one thing I would note is when I put this on I used solid wire and I realized with the door open and closing wouldn't work so I went back and on the end here that's going to attach to the door I used a very flexible stranded wire so this should stand up to the repeated open and closing and I'm going to leave a little bit of a slack in it too so it's not putting too much stress on it. So anyway uh, let me go out there and get this mounted and I'll show you how I mounted it up and uh, how it works. Here is I've just mounted it here on the back side. You see the wire coming out. Painted it black to match and then I run the wire underneath and then I just come down and I just stuck the sensor there on the door. So and I just tape the the wires up underneath it so that way it'll allow it to move freely. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe. And look forward to coming back and checking out my channel later.